This is skill number 12, perineal care for a female resident. So first, wash your hands. Knock, knock, knock. Hello, I'm nursing assistant Christine. Is it okay if I can come in? The resident says yes, so you walk in. Uh, before I get started, is it okay if I check your wristband? Okay, Mrs. Jones. Good morning, Mrs. Jones. Today, I'm here to uh, clean your private area. Is that okay with you? She verbalizes yes. Okay, Mrs. Jones, but before I get started, I actually have to leave the room to gather my supplies. So here's your call light. Hit your call light. If you need anything, I'll be right back, okay? So I'm gonna wash my hands, leave the room, gather my supplies. Knock, knock, knock. Mr. Jones, I'm back. Um, before I get started, let me actually uh, set up my um, workstation. So give me a moment. So my supplies are going to be two protective barriers, one for the table to put my supplies on. The next one will be a protective barrier to place under her. Bath blanket. Six washcloths, soap, two pairs of gloves, and the basin for water. Okay, Mrs. Jones, um, we're almost ready to get started, but let me go ahead and close the curtain for your privacy. Make sure that the wheels are locked for safety. Raise the bed to my working level to protect my back. And I'll go ahead and lower the side rail on the side that I'm working on. Go ahead and Put on my gloves. So the first thing we'll do, Mrs. Jones, um, I'm going to go ahead and remove your top sheets and replace it with a bath blanket so we can keep your sheets um, protected from any water, okay? So if you can assist me by holding the blanket in place. So make sure you do not shake the sheets. Just open it up. Mrs. Jones. So Mrs. Jones, if you can go ahead and hold the bath blanket in place, I'm just going to move your regular sheets down to the foot of your bed. Just make sure the sheets are at the foot of the bed and they're not touching the ground. Okay, Mrs. Jones. What I'm also going to need you to help me with is I'm going to scoot you over towards me in the three sections. So we're just going to lift your torso towards me on the count of three. One, two, three. Her midsection on the count of three, move over closer to me. One, two, three. And her legs on the count of three, move closer to me. One, two, three. All right. Also, Mrs. Jones, if I can have you cross your arms for me and cross your legs. You're gonna be rolling on to your left side. And when you're on your left side, if you can hold the side rail for me for support, that'd be great. It's okay, are you ready? One, two, three. All right, so at this point, I'll gather my supplies and just bring a little bit closer. I'll use this time to place this protective barrier on her bed. Mrs. Jones on the count three, you can go ahead and roll back on your back. Thank you. All right, just, could just lift up a little bit. Just make sure that this other is okay. All right, Mrs. Jones, doing okay so far? Great. So verbalize, gather water, have her check the temperature. Mrs. Jones, if you could check, check the temperature for me. Go ahead and place your hand in the bucket. How's the temperature? It's okay? Great. Next, Mrs. Jones, if you can uh, bend your legs for me. Be sure not to overexpose them. And so you'll get 
your washcloth. You'll get your first three for the vagina area. You'll fold your washcloth into fours. Okay, dip it in the water. Add soap. Lather it up. And you'll be using each different corner for a different portion. One, two, three, four. So you'll lift the towel up. Okay, Mrs. Jones. So one corner from one side of her vagina. One swipe, always down. Don't overexpose her. Open it up, next side for the next part. Downward stroke. Next one, down the middle. Next one, you will be spreading her labias open and go top to bottom. Done. Soil linen barrel. So the next towel will be for the rinse. Now you didn't double dip, so you can still reuse this water. Fold the washcloth into fours. And you'll do the same thing. Dip it in the water and you'll wipe the same way. So one corner from one side. Next corner for the other side. One four down the middle. Next one. Spread the labias apart, down the middle, done. Soiled linen barrel. Last towel for the pat dry. So we'll go ahead and, Mr. Jones, just pat dry. Done, soiled linen barrel. So assist Mrs. Jones' legs back to a flat position. At this point, I will go verbalize, change the water, get fresh new water change my gloves, wash my hands, add new gloves because we are going to another section of the body. I've got the water and I've asked her, okay, Mr. Jones, have you checked the temperature? And she's checked it. How's the temperature, Mrs. Jones, is that okay? She says it's great. Okay, Mrs. Jones, if you can cross your arms and your legs for me once more, you're gonna go ahead and um, turn to your side and just grab onto the side rail for support, okay? Cross her legs. Ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. Okay, so don't overexpose her body. So, We'll go ahead and get your next washcloth, another three, and we'll do the same thing. Fold it into fourths, dip it in the water, add soap, verbalize lathering it up, and you'll use each corner again, front to back, not this way, this way. So one butt cheek, wipe, next one, wipe, for the middle, wipe, Spread the butt cheeks, wipe, done. Soiled linen barrel. So the next one, this is gonna be for the rinse. We never double dip, so we can use this water still. Same thing again, fold your washcloth into fours and just do the same wiping. One corner, one side, one corner, the other side. Next corner, down the middle. Spread the butt cheeks, down the middle. Soiled linen. Next, final towel, pat dry. Pat dry. Pat dry. Pat dry. Done, soiled linen barrel. So now that they're out on their side, you can go ahead and remove the protective barrier that's on her bed. Mr. Jones, I'm just gonna go ahead and lift your leg a little bit. And remove your, your thing. Throw this in the trash. At this point, I'll verbalize cleaning up my supplies. Throwing this in the trash. I'll go ahead and remove my gloves. Verbalize, wash my hands. And assist Mrs. Jones back into her, her um, flat line position. Okay, Mrs. Jones, on the count of three, go ahead and lay back on your back. One, two, three. How you doing? Doing okay, Mrs. Jones? All right. So next, we'll go ahead Mr. Jones, I'll return your blanket to you. 
you can assist me by holding your regular sheets. Go ahead and move this bath blanket. Soiled linen barrel. Verbalize, sanitize my hands. Okay, Mrs. Jones, we're pretty much done. Is there anything else I could do for you? No? Okay. Well, let me go ahead and give you your call light. Here's your call light. If you need anything, hit your call light and I'll be right back. Raise the side rail back up. Put the bed in its lowest position. Just make sure that the wheels are locked once more. Go to the foot of the bed. Make sure her alignment's okay. She's aligned. Make sure her side table is within reach. Here you go, Mrs. Jones. So here's your remote and your books. And I'm done. So if you need anything, just remember to hit your call light and I'll be right back. I'll leave, wash my hands, open the curtain, wash my hands, and document. <laughs>